Midterms and Duke basketball. These are two examples of the two extremes at Duke University. On one side, you have the killer academics. On the other, the killer social life. And today, I have to face these two monsters at once, and it's going to be a battle. In other words, I have a midterm today, and then I'm going to a basketball game later today. So my midterm is at 1.30, so I have basically until then to study. I have class, but like, um, depending on how I feel, I may have to skip a couple classes just to be ready for that midterm. And then the basketball game is at 7, and I'm part of Duke student broadcasting. So I'll be like on the court filming, um, which is going to be super cool, but I'll still have to prepare for that. And um, it's going to be a long, busy day, but we're going to do it. I'm going to survive, and you guys get to see the older. So let's, let's freaking go. Okay, it's currently 11.56, I have class at 12, so I'm going to go to the class. I feel pretty prepared for the midterm, I still would like to study some more, so I'll probably, I'll probably be studying during class a little bit, which I don't recommend, always pay attention to class, kids. And then, I got my midterm at 1.30, and then from there we got some basketball game, yeah, yeah, yeah. I haven't eaten anything, I haven't eaten anything. So I mobile ordered some food. I'm gonna get it and then eat it during class and then I'll be ready for the midterm. Oh, let's do this. I've commandeered a study room for these last 30 minutes before I have my midterm. If you're interested, if you're interested, my midterm is on decision theory science. So that's all about how people will grapple with complex decisions, the mental shortcuts they'll make, a lot of stuff. And it's interesting to me because I'm creating my own marketing major. So I love to see how people think and just try to understand what engages people. Okay, I'm heading to class now. I'm even making sure to show up a couple minutes early just to be ready. Something I never do in terms of getting to class early, um, which just shows you how prepared and how ready I am for this freaking midterm. Midterm is done! I feel pretty good about it. I think I did pretty well. The studying definitely paid off. And now that that is over with, it is 3 p.m. Um, I have three hours to eat and to work on some homework. And then it's time for the basketball game. So let's freaking go! Okay, we're here, we're at the basketball game. I'm here with my boy Max. Max, say hi to the people. This is the media room, which is crazy. This is like my first time ever in the media room. This is my first time at a basketball game. Uh, and it's freaking crazy. The energy is insane. Oh, and, and, and you know what's crazy? You know what's crazy? My seat is like court side. Like I'm right under the basket. I have like the best seat in the house. I'm super, super excited. So let's, uh, let, let, let's, let's get ready. Let's go. Couple things I know, couple things I show, couple things I don't. I can tell you my problems, 
I can tell you my sins I can tell you my problems I'm uncomfortable in my skin I'm uncomfortable with my ends I'm uncomfortable with my friends I'm uncomfortable with my drinking I'm uncomfortable with my thinking I'm uncomfortable with my waist I'm uncomfortable in this space I'm uncomfortable on good days I'm uncomfortable on bad days I'm uncomfortable with my soul I'm uncomfortable with my heart I'm uncomfortable with myself I'm uncomfortable with my heart Okay, it's currently halftime So I'm back in the media place um, this game is freaking crazy. First of all, it's like so intense. Like as a um, as a person filming, because like I have like zero room to move. Duke is winning, Obvi. I'm getting some killer shots. I'll probably add some so you guys can see. Um, but yeah, this is awesome. This is freaking awesome. Once the game ends, we're just gonna rush to the locker room, get some uh, interviews there. I'm with my friend Max, and he's gonna be interviewing people, and then we'll get some uh, press coverage and. Call it a day. It's gonna be fun. All right, let's continue on. I need peace to borrow. Get that shit right back tomorrow. Somehow all the fans go bravo. Smile so much to hide my sorrow. Stay the shaky in Verado. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. That that was insane. That was insane. Not only was I courtside watching the game, but I freaking got to go to the locker room. I saw like the NCAA trophies and all the players. Oh my god. This is this is great. What a great night. What a freaking great night. I got all my stuff here. I'm trying to return it to the equipment room and then I'll be going back. It's uh, 941. I have to start editing my videos. I have to not only do I have to edit basketball videos, but I got some YouTube videos I gotta do too. So we're gonna do that. And I'm gonna eat a burger because I'm hungry. But I'm gonna end the vlog here. Uh, thanks for watching. I hope you really enjoyed it. I hope you stick with me as we go on this epic journey. Uh, and yeah. Ha!